Hello, Martin. This is a video response for you, and I know you're dead, and I almost want to laugh saying it. Um, but I think that we can genuinely connect to the consciousness, because in truth, all you were, all that your body was, was something for everyone to mirror a feeling or idea off of. So I'm just mirroring, when I have this conversation, I'm mirroring it off of your face, which is the magic of videos, that we can know people even if they're not there. I saw that you had fear. I saw it, I saw it in the video. When you were talking about all the different places that needed to become open and free in Georgia, um, I could tell it, it's not that it comes from within it's, it doesn't come from the places that it has to happen it comes from the personal journey and I saw you get nervous and look down at your papers when you were talking about uh, religion as soon as you start talking about God again you, you, you broke off you were having this deep conversation about humans and how they're the same and how we're connecting and then you start talking about God, and every, the, the, the train disrupted, because in truth, God, I was going to say there is no God, but that's not quite, that, it's not like that. There, God is a simplification of what's this experience that takes, you know, essentially, it's a never-ending experience. I don't think there is any absolution. Although I think we can be headed in one direction or another. We can be headed towards enlightenment or we can be headed away from enlightenment. And if we live towards enlightenment, we start to feel more enlightened. And it picks up speed. It, it just, it happens. Really happens. But it's a personal journey. And you can't have a day about you. Because it's not about you. It's not about the day. The day is just a made-up thing. There's this moment that's constantly happening. And we're affecting it and changing it. There shouldn't be a day. The things People associate the things you said with you, and that's why you closed off and allowed it to happen, because I'm not going to allow that to happen. What I say is not about me. I am nothing. When I die, I die. I'm gone. There is no Ian Crossland. I was just another body doing stuff. But the consciousness itself is ever-present with everyone. It's all happening together. It's all a giant growth process, and I couldn't do any of this without other people. It's just an overwhelmingly powerful experience. So you focus on relationships, and you open up. dangerous this video because it starts to become like another person all right anyway i know your body's dead but i think that uh the consciousness is always existing so when i say you i'm just talking to myself but maybe the fact that i'm talking to someone with a dead body it means that i'm manifesting my own death interesting so maybe this is a bad idea. Well, what is a bad idea? I don't want to manifest my own death, so I'm not doing that. I'm actually interested in what you said.